Hi, <clears throat> it's me, Jordan Long, and today I'm going to talk about something that, you know, happens. Now, you all know about Wreck-It Ralph, right? The uh, farce, the game selfhood that wanted to be a good man instead of being a bad man. Now, he went on to have this other film called He Breaks the Interweb. But then again, I don't really think he could ever break the interweb. But, <clears throat> so, there were, so, there were toys that were made for the McDonald's Happy Meal for this film. And some of them I don't really quite understand. They're in, car, they're in far cards. Far carts, you know. Now, don't ask me why this is, since I really don't know. But it'd be like, does it have anything to do with the film? Probably not. But, you know, it is what it is. It had, you know, nothing to do with the film. And it'd be like this. Eh, well, you don't got anything to do with the film, do you? No, I don't. like you don't have anything to do with the film oh, no. oh. it's like no I don't have anything to do with the film ain't that sad you know Jordan said because I don't know why you're in the far card for if you have something to do with Wrecked Ralph breaks the interweb then why are you in the far card I don't know and it's like I got a bunch of hair that now needs to be cut off of me. So I'm going to have to do that. You know, it's like a pain in the butt. I mean, I get it. I got doll hair. And you all know how doll hair goes. It gets messy. And no matter how much combing you do or whatever, it never does ever get back to where it was. <clears throat> you know, it's worse than living hair. Worse than living being hair. So anyway, yeah, she don't know it, but someone from McDonald's or someone that made the toys from McDonald's thought that, well, we got to make toys based off of Wrecked Ralph or Wrecked Ralph Breaks the Interweb. Well, I know, pull them in far carts, you know, because sometimes I don't think they, I mean, don't get me wrong, I like the toys I get from the McDonald's Happy Meal. I mean, they're good. Sometimes they're the only toys that you're actually, they're actually, you're going to, you know, be made. But sometimes I don't understand why they do this. Oh, why am I in a far card for? Yeah, I don't know. Do you know? I don't know. Is it anything to do with uh, Record Ralph Breaks the Interweb? No, I don't think it has anything to do with Record Ralph Breaks the Interweb. Which is actually probably t truth, you know, unless that's unless that's the game they're all in, unless Wrecked Ralph Two game that the South Hoods are in, or you know a, 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 a racing game or a driving game, I guess a driving game, and yeah, probably is what it is. And uh, am I right? Is it a driving game that wreck it Ralph, that Ralph Breaks the Interweb is based it about? Yes, it is. Well, you should have told me. Because I was going out talking about how this had nothing to do with that film. And apparently it does have something to do with that film. So you should have told me. But sadly, Jordan says some folks, oh. But sadly, Jordan says some folks out there didn't tell me. So I'm going around thinking that, oh, McDonald's or whoever made them just, you know, put them in it. I guess in the film, they're in a driving game. And then something happens. And then Ralph has to go and break the interweb to stop something bad from happening. But there's no way that Ralph can break the interweb. A South Hood from a... Farseer game. Um, it is what it is. You know, 
I'm Jordan Long, and I'll see you later.